Seven Pax has been driving the Cypher Dome ciphers. This is what we're going to talk about today. The Cypher yes, Dome ciphers. Yes, sir. Thanks for coming to the garden, hanging out on RFP Media Presents. Thank you for having me, man. Always good to be here. What are you doing these days? Man, lots. Yeah? Trying to stay busy, man. I just, I like creating, I like building. So it's not just the music, it's also the community, you know, helping some other artists that don't have all the opportunities that, uh, you know, that I have, that I like to give other people and things like that. So it's, it's more than just making the music, it's also about creating the scene and, yeah. and uh, the art behind it, you know? So it's like, we have a big machine behind us and we're having lots of fun, man. Yeah, I've been listening to your stuff on Spotify. Mm -hmm. How many tracks? You have four tracks up on Spotify? Right now, now I have about four tracks, did you, yeah. When did you start four posting five. music? Um, Online. shoot, I started posting music when MySpace was the thing. When was that? How long oh, ago? Oh man, I probably was like 15 years old and what I was, was in the a closet with like a little messed up Do you remember the name of the first track? Um, shoot, no, I don't remember the name was of the it first rap? track. It was hip hop, yeah. It was really aggressive. It was really um, content driven, like multi-syllabic, like da -da 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 Like it was very like, you know what I mean? Yeah. Young and, and raw and fun. It was cool, like, yeah. So how have you evolved since then? <clears throat> um, since then, I just try to challenge myself every time I'm in front of a microphone and try to make my next product uh, better than my last one, basically. Yeah. So um, a lot of singing, you know what I mean? A lot of R&B. Um, just challenging, my, challenging myself vocally, you know what I mean? I don't want to be in that box of just being a rapper or a, you know, like I don't, yeah. I don't, I don't want to be just in that title. I don't want to be in that, <clears throat> in that light. So I try to just push myself and, and make all sorts of different kinds of music, you know what I mean? Who out there inspires you these days? Who do you watch to get pumped up, to get on the right track mentally? My friends, man. My, my brothers that are around me constantly building and pushing and like who? motivating like seven packs, like Noah Iman, like yeah. Rich Forte, like, you know what I mean? Like the people that I keep around me, I'm in this constant, um, building state of mind and it's where I feel the most comfortable so why do you love hip-hop rap culture um, this kind of stuff what is it that you identify it's with the, so much for me it's the voice of, uh, of it's the voice of the unheard you know it's like it's the voice of the underdogs it's the voice of uh, people that you know maybe didn't grow up in, with like I said, every opportunity in the world, but they still manage to find a way to make it work and they still find a way to, you know, to turn their situation around. And I just love that. I love, I love the, the feel of hip hop. Like there's such a powerful spirit behind it. Yeah. And I just really resonate with that. That's and, awesome. and I love it. It just motivates me. You know what I mean? Like it's just, yeah. Where do you see yourself going in the next year? So in the next year, um, I'm just freestyling this off the top of my head based on things I do yeah. want to accomplish, but I'm going to say, I want to have, in the next 12 months, I would like to have four music videos out, accomplished, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. out, fully promoted, I want to put a lot of time and energy behind each one specifically. I'd like to have, let's say, four in the next 12 months. Okay, that's very specific. I want to have a full album done, out, released, I have two EPs in the works as well with some other artists, smaller yeah. kind of projects. I would like to have both of those projects done as well. And, um, and I would like to accomplish a really, really nice big event community wise yeah. for, for the I'm going to help you with that. Scene. Yeah. I'm going to help you with so that. I think we're in the right place too. So That's fantastic. Yeah. Thanks so much for coming out and agreeing to do this show. And Thank now we're going to so tell much, people man. to go watch this little session you had at Seven Packs Studio, yeah. Cypher Dome yeah. Industries. Cypher Dome Cyphers is something yeah. you're gonna to wanna to check out. We're gonna be coming out, I think, with one at least every Saturday. That's the mission so far, at least that's what we're gonna target. Yeah. I think you are the second one. Number two. You are Cypher Dome Cyphers number, number two. two. My brother DSF was the first one. Why don't you send people off to, to the uh, Cypher Dome Cypher right now, tell them, uh, what they, what they got coming. So Cypher Dome series is doing a video podcast kind of series where it's like um, just real raw hip hop talent. You know what I mean? It's like we're taking it back 
to the essence of what this is supposed to be like yeah and seven packs is producing a beat and you guys are going on it exactly there's no funny fx there's no funny um it's just, auto tune it's just very straightforward let's see what you got kind yeah. of thing you know because love it we're just cutting the fat we're trimming the fat on this one and we're just seeing what everybody has and what everybody can bring to the table in terms of being an artist being a writer and stuff yeah. so so come down to cypher dome series man come check us out come check out seven packs hit rich up that's right hit one of us up to get involved man and and um, come have fun with us, man. That's this right. shit is, come on, baby. Yeah. Hey man, thanks for hanging out at Sweet 16 Studios and helping out with the fam. There's a lot of good things happening in the studio right now and right. you're right in that mix and it's really right. exciting I'm and fun. Blessed Check out it, on man. Instagram, at Sweet 16 Studio. Yeah. Thanks for coming in. I can't wait to see what you're gonna do over the next year. I'm gonna be following it. I'm sure I'm gonna get you on to some of my projects. Oh, so, yeah. uh, I'm excited, man. I'm excited. Check them out, East End <laughs> Sinatra. <laughs> Hey, make sure you come down to Sweet 16 Studios at 176 Lakeshore Avenue if you want your music done properly. This is where you need to be, okay? Come check us out, man. East End Sinatra said so. Do what you're told. <laughs>